Just I have a lot of Misfits uh, uh, stuff. I collect a lot of Misfits stuff over the years. Well, this is the, I think the, the Misfits, uh, I think the Fiend mask is the coolest, dude. It's awesome. It's awesome. Wow, man. There wow. you go. So did I call you and, and you were working like in a body shop, though? I have a machine shop. That's where we make the spikes and we build our guitars and we uh, rehearse there. 24,000 square feet. If you need a place to set up, you can come by me. Wow. And this, where, where is this, in New Jersey? Jersey, up in the hills. Yeah. Yeah. Near Passaic? Uh, about 40 miles north. We're in, uh, uh, act, like, where Action Park is uh, where the uh, ski slopes are. You have, uh, you've lost weight since I saw you. A lot. 50, uh, 20 pounds. Well, it's touring. Touring, right? And no, 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 no. What I did was I, I kind of flipped up my diet. I wound up uh, eating, like, a lot of vegetables and... Yeah. and I did this. Speaking uh, of eating, whatever happened with you and Tamara Holder? You ever munch that? No, I never no, did. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I bet Nelson wants to munch that. He wants to munch that. Pretty good. What's that? Is she Nelson? Can- well, we should yeah. call her. We should call her. Listen, we have something going on right now, Jerry only. Uh, and what's who's this? That's who's my that? son, Jerry. Oh. Other is my Jerry. Son. Other. He plays. He plays yeah, guitar okay. in the band. Wow. All right. All right. Let's yeah, uh, yeah. let's let's listen to a little bit of uh, let's listen a little. Let's listen to uh, a little bit of the Misfits, ladies and gentlemen. They are here in our studio live. <laughs> You excited? Oh my god. This is the greatest thing ever. I never thought this would happen. A Misfits reunion, Jerry and Danzig. I thought it would never happen. I can't believe it. Do they do they still Well, you got to ask them. We just came from LA. Do you still hate each other? Are you or is is it better or where's it at? No, it's it's a lot better. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I I think, you know, maturity has its uh, upside, I think. Uh-huh. So uh-huh. No, it's good. Uh we uh we've come to a position where we're we're How's thinking, it sounding? It's sounding really fat. Yeah, it's, yes, it's really good, and uh, we just came like, from like our sports cast. Yep. Fat is good. Yeah, fat is good. <laughs> fat is good. <laughs> <laughs> the Misfits are in our studio, ladies and gentlemen. The Misfits are here. This is new, right? Friday Thirteenth. Yeah, new Misfits music. It's seven a.m. at the greatest rock and roll radio station on earth, The Loop. Katie. Yeah. Okay, we have time for you. So what what's the misfits are here and uh, maybe they'll give you some advice. What, what's what's issue? Right. Well, she has yes. an issue. She needs some help. Yeah. I need help. Yeah. So I was saying that uh, my boyfriend is very effeminate. Yeah. That's a problem <laughs> misfits that. don't have. <laughs> no, clearly. With big spikes um. <laughs> and skulls. Your boyfriend is very effeminate. What is going on? And by the way, I, I feel like I always have to say this. Effeminate doesn't equal gay. That's no. right. Okay? Way different. No, no. I don't, I don't under... Not necessarily. You could be effeminate and gay. I'm just saying there are there are very effeminate guys, and there's very masculine guys that are, uh, you know, they're power tops. That's right. Right. Like <laughs> well, my boy know. Abe over there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm a bottom. What, what do you... What, you're a bottom? What? What are you doing? Oh, wait. wait okay. Yeah. Other way around. He, is, he is today. Okay. Uh, Jerry only. Uh, the Misfits. Um, I'm ready. Okay. So what's the question, though? He's just very sensitive and... Yeah, he's sensitive and in touch with his emotions, but, you, you know, he's metrosexual. Metrosexual. Um, and I just um, never thought it was a problem. Okay. Um, and then last weekend, mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure deeper. that I I saw him at a gay bar. You saw him at a gay bar? You saw him at a gay bar? Well, look, okay. I can't answer these questions now. It's, it's yeah. out of my league. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, I mean, he I told me one. he was going out for guys' night. Is he with Johnny Cakes? And... I just, I'm afraid to confront him about it. You know, like, what if he is actually gay and he leaves me and, and then, or he's not gay. Okay. Okay. And then he'll think I'm spying well, on let me, him. Let me ask the misfits and everybody here in our studio. Now, listen, I, I, what if, what if, like, I like to go to gay bars just because I drink free then. And anyone else? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't like me. Is that, uh, and I like to dance, you know, without the pressure. I like to dance without the pressure of having that sack because it's not going to happen. Cause, you know, hey, somebody call me a cab. Because I'm not gay. I'm not gay. And, you know, I don't want my wife to get jealous of me dancing with all these hot women. Absolutely. So, I'll, you know, but I, yet I want to dance. Yeah. And I want to sing. You and know? you're a great dancer. And, and thank you. And I like show tunes, you know. You do. And, um, in fact, Leslie and I were dancing to uh, Journey. Yeah. And I thought it was fun. It wasn't. Yeah, it was great. Yeah, you know. <laughs> Uh, Mako has a bubble butt. <laughs> you know, I think you may have had a Sharpie in your pocket or something. Uh, yeah, uh, like yeah. Poking me. I don't know. Um, so, so you saw your you saw your guy at a gay bar. You don't want to confront him. 
You don't know what to do. Um, right. Well, Jerry, only well, misfits. Uh, uh, come on, man, jump uh, in here. Uh, 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 I'd say it's uh, time to bail. I'd say. <laughs> I'd say it's. <laughs> you got to confront. I'd him. say it's. I'd say it's time to bail too. I would say that relationship is over, man. I, I mean, might, if if he if he ain't telling you what's up, uh, what, I, unless what, what, you what, what, want other men in your yeah. life, unless he's bisexual, or are you? If he is gay, are you okay with that? Do you want to continue to have a? I mean, you can still be friends. You know. What? I mean, yeah. I mean, if I find out that he that he is gay, then I I clearly can't stay in the relationship <laughs> but you don't want to ask him if he's gay and yet you see him at a gay bar you, yeah oh, you can I always know, follow him right. and confront him there boy I, am i just the bravest person on earth yeah this is a weird topic yeah. for the misfits no because no because i would just i would just ask why i mean what well, is yeah, why is everybody yeah, saying yeah, yeah, hey uh jim i saw you at a gay bar and i know <laughs> you taste a little different lately right. uh, <laughs> oh, budgy in a way <laughs> yeah Katie, I would. Yeah. Misfits, we all, everybody, Al, everybody, we agree. Yeah, yeah. agree. Yeah. 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 The relationship is over. Right. Glad I could do this on the radio for you. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh, Jerry and I are uh, buddies. We we talk to each other, and uh, we've become friends from, from the yeah, Misfits. Sure. And we've done TV and other things together, and I don't know that Jerry knows. You know, you know, Jerry, when you called and you said, uh, well, I can't really talk about it, but I, you, you, I don't know if you knew that, but we were on the, we, we were on the radio at that point. Did you know that? No, nah, you were always on the radio. <laughs> <laughs> it's always good to assume. It's not, it's not news to yeah, me. Yeah, even when he's not on the radio... You're on the radio. He's, he's, you know what I mean? Yeah, 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 he's yeah, he's pounding out it's fenders a, or something it, at, at mom's uh, body shop. Yeah, and, right. Well, I can't really talk, but Glenn and I are going to be doing a show. And, <laughs> and I'm like, oh, We had it before anyway. We did yeah, you were, you were first. You were. But I, I didn't mean to set you up. I just. No, you can set yeah, me up. I, I heard the rumor. <laughs> I called you. And then uh, it's, it's how, how big of a deal is it? Uh well it's it's pretty big it's uh, huge yeah, yeah. I, I think so I think uh, after a third of a century we're back together and uh, it just so happens everybody's been uh, working their game hitting the weights and you know getting ready to play we've been making gear to bust over people's heads and it's all good so <laughs> Chad uh, Chad are you there All right yeah. so this is what we're doing the misfits are here oh, ladies and beautiful. gentlemen the misfits are here All right. Okay, Kathy, pick a number between 1 and 50, and I'm just going to hit the phone. So you pick okay. a number. Number 9. Okay, number 9 is uh, Joy. Joy, are you there? Mm. I am here. Number okay. 9. All right, so we got a lot of people hanging on, lots of great stuff to give away. No pressure, Joy. Some big ticket items. Right. The question is uh, going to be, uh, Jerry from the Misfits is here, the band The Misfits, legendary band. Jerry, That's right, your, up early for you. Yeah, what's your just question, you. Jerry? This song won Best Song for the Cars. It was the first ever best video winner on MTV. First ever best video winner. A song by the Cars. What is it? Oh, give me a second. Let me think here. Let me think. I think I, know. I think I think she I might think, know it. I think, I think she I might think know it. I know it as well. Well, it's your birthday. You she might be going on. Come on, Al. Al You might, Roker, help you me might think you know it, but I, you're, I, I think you're crazy. I think you can come yeah. up with it. Everybody win or lose right now. Go ahead, Joy. What's the answer? Dude, I don't know. <laughs> oh, help me out, Al Roker. <laughs> Al could be her lifeline. I, I, uh, it's, be my lifeline. I tried, man, Cal. You tried. Oh, I uh, said you might think you know, but you're crazy. Yeah. You might think I'm crazy. The first MTV Best Song winner on uh, this day. Everybody just. I want everybody oh. to win everybody this no. oh, oh, so hard. I'm sorry. Pig out for charity. That's something that we can do, right? Only in America. Pig out for charity. We'll tell you about it. The Misfits reunion finally happening. They're in our studio right now. Sports headlines, ADD news coming up, and uh, we got a lot of stuff to get away now. Hang on.
an hour commercial free is coming up next. Al, what's going on in sports? The end of the baseball trading deadline is Chris Sale, still a member of the White Sox. Hey, what what do you call that? The, the, Double lock. No, that thing hanging down. What's Double that? lock. What's the devil it? lock. The devil lock. Devil lock. What do you do with that when you're not on stage? Does it stick straight pick, up? Pick my nose. Okay. <laughs> His hair hangs all the way down like that. Very useful. Jerry only, and your boy's name is? Jerry. Other. Jerry Other. Uh, Jerry Jerry other. other. I like that. Okay. Right. And That'll he has work. the double lock, too. Hey, you know you can oh, pick nice your nose. Yeah. You can... Pick your ass, but you can't pick your family. Yeah, all right. You can pick your friends. That's not it. You can pick your friends. You can pick your ass, but you can't pick your... Never mind. <laughs> We're going to Riot Fest, dude. We're going to Denver. Make out. If you're coming, give me give me your list. I'll, I'll, I'll turn it in. No, I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm well, coming. All right. Do you want to do our sound? I see the way you work those yeah, knobs. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll uh, be glad to tweak your knobs there. That would be great. <laughs> yeah. The Misfits yeah. are here, and then September 18th, uh, they're going to be on stage. The original Misfits uh, yes, reunion. Riot Fest. Douglas Riot Fest. Park. Danzig, Special Jerry, and uh -huh. Doyle. Back, uh -huh. no one thought it would ever happen. Yeah, 30, it's happening. Thirty-three years, boys. Wow. That's why I want to go to Denver in case that's the only show. Yeah, that's in before case, our show. In case stuff doesn't work out. Yeah. <laughs> that's why I want to go to Denver just in case. Because wow. it might not work out. Well, you guys have been well, 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 you've yeah, been rehearsing. Haven't yeah, you? We, actually, we flew in uh, yesterday morning from LA. We rehearsed last week. Uh, it went well. It, uh -huh. it sounded good and. Uh, you know, it's uh, you're trying to get the technical end of it down and, you know, lock that down. So, uh, you know, Glenn's open. We're working together and we're showing each other a little bit respect, everybody. And that's what gets you through. So what ended it before? Uh, there was a difference in uh, direction. Uh, <laughs> it, my, my, my brother went a little bit to the metal side and well. uh, and uh, Glenn obviously did his Sam Hain and his dancing stuff. And, you know, I was I was I like keeping the band a punk band. I think that the. Uh, you know the Ramones uh, and you know Misfits, The Clash, things like this. Is, it's going to live forever. So I think trying to fit into something that uh, may be trending at the time. You know, like all of a sudden all that death metal and dark metal was in the eighties. Uh, I by stepped all that and I just waited my time and and. Uh, so you've always been a punk. Yeah, I'm, yeah, yeah. And I see your son's a punk too. Yeah, he is. <laughs> yeah. He looks a little deader than me. He's hitting that hot chick in the back of the studio. <laughs> he is hitting uh, her. And he's <laughs> That's a funny visual. He's looking like you a little bit now. All, all of a, all of a sudden, he's moved from behind Kathy's ass over to the, <laughs> the yeah, other Greek the girl. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when opportunity here, knocks, opportunity. and we mean knocks. <laughs> if you like ass, you'll like Greek girls. It's a fact. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, man. Where were we? Kathy, you have a song. You're going to play a song for us there, aren't That's you? That's right. Yep. All right. And On the Misfits are here. Sports headlines coming up. You know, you know what I want to do? What? I want to break them up again. That's what my job is when they're I'm sure you <laughs> will do it. And come very, very close. <laughs> I think it'll be pretty easy. Yeah. That's, that's why I'm going to Denver. Because I, I have to see them before they I, break can up. I tell, can I tell you what? Because, you know, I'm, you can already tell. We're going we're gonna to be hanging. This is my boy. I'm going to be hanging backstage and stuff. Oh, yeah. I'm going to be like, Jerry was just saying, you're kind of a little asshole. <laughs> <laughs> what, was, what, was that, what was that word he was calling him? Uh, a pipsqueak. <laughs> a little sawed-off piece of shiznit is what Jerry's uh, Hey, have a good show tonight. And then I just go back and watch. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I...